I'm, I'm an odd job man, really. Uh, I, I do all sorts of things, but I, I'm in a fortunate position that I, I do the things that interest me now. So I engage with all sorts of institutions in order to, uh, I suppose it sounds a bit naive and silly, but to try to make the world a slightly better place in the areas where I think I may be able to make a contribution. So I, I work through the UK's National uh, Academy for Engineering, the, the Royal Academy of Engineering. I work through the Institution of Engineering and Technology, the IET. Uh, but I'm, I'm also a visiting professor at a number of universities, at, at Oxford, at Aberystwyth, at Bristol, and give occasional lectures there. And, and I work with other universities helping with research programs. I, I chaired the executive committee for a major European project recently that was introducing mathematically formal software development methods into a number of European industries that were partners in that project and monitoring the effects and, and learning from that. So I, I get involved in all sorts of areas of activity. I, I'm a member of the Defence Science Advisory Council. Uh, so I, I do a lot of work with the Ministry of Defence, particularly looking at cyber security most recently. I, uh, I'm a non-executive director of the Health and Safety Executive because a lot of my background has been in safety critical computing systems. And so I'm particularly keen to ensure that workplace activities don't damage the health and safety of people at work or of people who are affected by those workplace activities. We, we, we want a healthy workforce, we want people to go home to their families at, at night without leaving bits of their bodies behind trapped in machinery. So the HSE is doing a terrific job I and mean, we, we are acknowledged world leaders in providing a cost-effective and um, properly based health and safety framework and safety culture in the UK that quite demonstrably leads to lower accidents than in almost every other country around the world. So I'm, I'm very proud to be able to make a contribution to that as well.